These three metrics suggest the Bitcoin price crash is not over $20,000 feels scary, but it may not be the end of the story for Bitcoin's latest bear cycle. Markets News Bitcoin, BTC, near $20,000 is worrying the market, but after narrowly avoiding breaking support, is the worst really over? According to multiple on-chain indicators, it seems that Max Payne has yet to arrive this cycle. The stakes are high for many hodlers this week. Almost 50% of the supply is being held at a loss and miners are upping their shipments of BTC to exchanges. Even some of Bitcoin's biggest investors, notably MicroStrategy, are having to defend their conviction on BTC as price action tumbles. With targets ranging as low as $11,000, Cointelegraph takes a look at how much further the market technically needs to drop to match historical bottom zones. Weak hodlers still to be flushed out despite the drop to 18 month lows. Bitcoin price action has not yet shaken out all its speculators. According to the Rodel ratio from Philip Swift, creator of on chain analytics resource Look into Bitcoin, more capitulation should be on the way. This is because historically, the ratio between short term and long term hodlers has been more in favor of the latter at macro price bottoms. Rodel specifically takes the ratio between the one week and the one to two year cohorts of the realized cap hodl waves metric, which divides coins by when they last moved weighted by realize price. Essentially, once Rodel's green zone is it, it suggests that capitulation is at its peak and follow the URL for the full article for more on this story, visit the news article link.